Welcome to our channel. In the realm of social media, a spectral presence haunts Mark Zuckerberg's Facebook empire Snapchat. Adorned with a ghostly emblem, Snapchat's ephemeral allure challenges Facebook's supremacy. With unique features and captivating essence, it casts a spell on millions. The battle for social media dominance unfolds as Snapchat captivates a new generation with real-time sharing and fleeting moments. Its ghost logo symbolizes the enigmatic appeal, disrupting Facebook's reign. As Snapchat's innovative features continue to enthrall users, its ghostly presence lingers, haunting Zuckerberg's empire. Join us as we delve into the intriguing tale of Snapchat, forever changing the social media landscape. Let's begin. Imagine a remarkable turn of events. In less than two years, Facebook attempted to acquire Snapchat for an astounding $3 billion. But why would such a staggering offer be made for an app that initially struggled to gain traction? Let's delve into the intriguing story of Snapchat and its co-founders, Evan, Reggie, and Bobby. Despite facing a lukewarm reception in the beginning, Evan and Bobby pressed forward, dedicating themselves to improving the app. While Bobby tirelessly coded, Evan focused on the app's design and vision. He keenly observed the App Store, noticing a lack of apps with yellow logos. And thus, Snapchat's distinct bright yellow background was born, setting it apart from the crowd. However, tensions arose within the co-founder trio. Reggie, just 21 at the time, seemed more interested in revelry than contributing to the business. This disparity in commitment fostered resentment and strained their once strong bond. Overhearing discussions of his potential removal, Reggie confronted Evan and Bobby, sparking a heated argument that shattered their harmony. The question loomed, how would this impact the future of Snapchat? Unbeknownst to them, a seismic shift was about to occur. Suddenly, Snapchat experienced an extraordinary surge in users, particularly among teenagers. The numbers skyrocketed, growing from 2,000 daily active users in December to a staggering 20,000 in January. But why did Snapchat strike a chord with this demographic? Unlike other social media platforms, Snapchat offered a refreshing alternative. It created a private club atmosphere, a sanctuary away from the prying eyes of parents and grandparents who had flocked to Facebook. Furthermore, Snapchat's ephemeral nature allowed users to share casual, unfiltered glimpses of their lives. There was no pressure to present a perfected image. Instead, it became a platform for authenticity. No likes, no retweets, just pure, unadulterated fun. The surge in users caught the attention of investors, enabling Snapchat to secure funding and expand its team. Evan's tireless efforts to garner new users, from reaching out to bloggers to distributing flyers in malls, began to pay off. However, misconceptions persisted, with many viewing Snapchat as a mere gimmick or a platform for sexting, raising concerns about the young user base. As Snapchat's popularity soared, Reggie re-emerged on the scene, filing a lawsuit against Evan and Bobby, claiming unjust removal from the company. The legal battle that ensued tested the resilience of the co-founders, but eventually, a settlement was reached, granting Reggie a lump sum payment in exchange for silence regarding Snapchat. Meanwhile, Snapchat continued its remarkable growth. By October 2012, the app boasted a staggering 20 million photos sent each day. And when Snapchat introduced video messages a few months later, its trajectory soared even higher. It became a favored mode of communication for teenagers, replacing traditional text messaging. Personal moments captured in an instant, accompanied by brief captions, formed the essence of Snapchat's appeal. But the story doesn't end there. Mark Zuckerberg, the driving force behind Facebook, took note of Snapchat's success. He extended an invitation to Evan, expressing admiration for Snapchat's achievements and proposing a partnership. However, Evan chose to decline the offer, determined to maintain Snapchat's independence and unique identity. In a surprising twist, Zuckerberg unveiled Facebook's own clone of Snapchat, called Poke, during their meeting. Yet, Poke's imitation failed to gain traction and soon faded into obscurity. The lack of differentiation from Snapchat and users' aversion to connecting the app with their Facebook accounts contributed to its downfall. Snapchat emerged triumphant, having weathered the storms of internal strife, legal battles, and competition from tech giants. 
It proved itself as a legitimate communication tool, capturing the hearts of millions of users worldwide. Evans' decision to resist the temptation of a lucrative acquisition paid off, enabling Snapchat to preserve its authenticity and cater to a growing user base. So, what happened to Facebook's attempt to buy Snapchat for $3 billion? Well, their own copycat app, Poke, completely flopped, ultimately leading to its termination. It seemed that Snapchat's unique disappearing photo concept couldn't be easily replicated. In just one year, Snapchat's user base exploded, reaching over a million daily active users who were sending more than 100 million photos each day. But how did Snapchat manage to surpass Facebook in popularity among young users? Snapchat's introduction of stories, allowing users to broadcast their experiences, proved to be a game changer. It created a sense of urgency, compelling users to check the app daily to avoid missing out. As Snapchat continued to innovate with new features like camera lenses and public stories, Facebook's Mark Zuckerberg grew increasingly determined to acquire the rising social media platform. In a bold move, Zuckerberg offered a staggering $3 billion to acquire Snapchat, despite its limited revenue and unproven business model. This offer put Evan and Bobby, Snapchat's co-founders, in a dilemma. They were tempted by the life-changing financial gain the acquisition would bring, but they ultimately decided to reject Zuckerberg's offer and continue running Snapchat themselves. Snapchat faced its fair share of challenges, including privacy concerns, security breaches, and criticism from the media. However, it began exploring various monetization strategies such as paid replays and the introduction of Snapcash for peer-to-peer -peer money transfers. But the real potential for revenue came from advertising, as Snapchat became an attractive platform for reaching a younger demographic. Although its ad platform was not as advanced as Facebook's, its appeal to advertisers targeting the youth market allowed ad revenue to flow in. While Facebook made numerous attempts to copy Snapchat's features, Instagram Stories in particular gained immense popularity and surpassed Snapchat in terms of daily active users. This development, coupled with controversies and criticism faced by Snapchat, led some to question its future. However, Snapchat continued to innovate, expanding its focus beyond the app itself. With the launch of Snapchat Spectacles and its investments in augmented reality technology, Snap Inc. positioned itself as a leading player in AR experiences, potentially reshaping how we perceive the world. As Snap's journey continues, its long-term strategy remains uncertain. Will it carve a niche in the metaverse, compete head-to-head -head with Facebook's meta, or focus on transforming how we experience reality with AR glasses? Only time will tell. But one thing is for sure. The story of Snapchat is far from over, with more twists and turns yet to come. While Snapchat's growth has been remarkable, it has not been without its controversies and challenges. However, the company's commitment to innovation and its unique position in the market suggest that the story of Snapchat is far from over. Whether it will continue to dominate the social media landscape or face new competitors remains to be seen. But one thing is certain. Snapchat has made a lasting impact and revolutionized the way we communicate and share our experiences. In conclusion, Snapchat's journey has been a roller coaster ride, full of ups and downs, triumphs, and controversies. What started as a seemingly simple messaging app for sharing disappearing photos has evolved into a global phenomenon that has captured the attention of millions of users, especially the younger generation. Snapchat's unique features like stories and augmented reality lenses have set it apart from its competitors and demonstrated its potential for innovation. Throughout its history, Snapchat has faced challenges, from failed acquisition attempts by Facebook to security breaches and privacy concerns. However, it has consistently demonstrated resilience and an ability to adapt and evolve. Despite Facebook's attempts to copy its features and capture its audience, Snapchat has remained a force to be reckoned with. Snapchat's success lies in its ability to connect with young users who value authenticity, privacy, and a more casual approach to social media. It has created a space where users can be themselves without the pressure of presenting a perfect image or accumulating likes. This has allowed Snapchat to cultivate a loyal and engaged user base. Looking ahead, Snapchat's future holds promise and potential. 
With its foray into hardware such as Snapchat Spectacles and its continued investments in augmented reality, the company is positioning itself at the forefront of technological innovation. By exploring new avenues beyond the app itself, Snapchat aims to redefine how we experience reality and communicate with one another. As the story of Snapchat unfolds, it serves as a reminder that innovation, perseverance, and staying true to your core values can help a company navigate through turbulent waters. Snapchat remains the ghost that haunts Zuckerberg and other social media giants, reminding them that capturing the hearts and minds of users is no easy feat. And that was it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give this a like, comment, and subscribe down below. Share the video to all and tap on the bell icon so you never miss an upload. I shall see you in the next video.